watch? Yeah, I did. You know what this is? This is the title. Yeah. You don't have one. Your so? ass is fired. What the hell is wrong with you? I don't need you anymore. You're yes, not a champion. You do. Get the hell out. You're fired. Oh my god! Johnny Psycho. Tonight, this is my belt. This is my realm. I am the king of the pure division. After tonight, I don't have to see you ever again. JT Lambo, tonight is Legacy X, the 10th anniversary of Legacy, and how sweet, how bittersweetly fitting that it's named Legacy X, because Legacy X marks the spot, the spot of the end of JT Lambo and Johnny Psycho feud, the end of this blood-filled rivalry, the end of me and you, our little grudge. Tonight, JT Lambo, I'm walking out with my fourth, that's right, fourth, that's right, fourth, that's right, fourth! Pure championship, and you are walking out with nothing. Hey, those were your words, not mine. I wasn't the one who said, hey, loser has to leave the division. No, that was you. So I hope you eat your words. I hope you're ready. I hope you're in the back tonight after you lose. I hope you're in the back crying, crying your eyes out, because you will not walk out champion. JT Lambo, you've had everything handed to you in WAW. Somebody like me has worked for everything I've had. You. You've had stuff handed to you, whether it was then-President Moody Starr, whether it was then-President Sin, whether it was Red Guy last month at Lord of the Ring. You've had everything handed to you. And speaking of having everything handed to you, since I'm in the Muta, shoot from the hip in 2008, the only reason why you were in the dynasty is because yours truly wasn't part of WAW. I was friends with Christian Sane. I was friends with CBZ. I was friends with Moops way before you knew what a wrist lock to a wrist watch was, buddy. So, those are the breaks, kid. But guess what? Tonight, I want you to know three things. If you're going to know three things, you know these three things. Number one, thou shalt not fuck with Johnny Psycho ever, ever, ever again. Number two, I hope you're ready to kick the tires and light them fires, boy, because for the next 20 minutes, the next 1,200 legacy moment filled seconds, your ass is mine, and I'm going to get medieval on that ass. And number three, it's the most important thing there is on this list, JT. Number three is, when it's all said and done, the smoke clears, the dust settles, and Johnny Psycho is standing, the new pure champion. I get back my crown. I am the uncrowned king, and I reclaim my top prize in the pure division. I want you to know that when it's all said and it's all done like I just said it was, my name will be up there with the greats. My name will be up there with people like the War Machine Sin, the Outlaw, Dirty Dealer, the Living Curse Sick, Gino Diomedes, F.O., Christian Sane, the likes of the Jersey Devil, the likes of... Let's go, Holy crap, Rocco, I was just about to say your... Wow. I know. That, that's crazy. You're really? Ready? Yeah. You ready for your How you doing, buddy? I am so ready. Yeah. Wow. Jesus. I'm sorry. I'm kind of scared you, man. Just, man, this well, is how Pumped up you already? Yeah, dude. I, Roy Grade just, I don't take Roy's, but shit. Take Roy? Jesus. Uh, no, I, I, I don't, I don't take, Roy's. take Roy's. Man. You don't have. Alright, well, whatever, whatever. Alright, you want to walk with me to the stairs? Yeah, there, right? Let's go. Man. Okay, cool. Alright. Is that candy? What? Is that candy in that bag? No, it's, it's for the crowd, though, but it's not candy. Why can't we have candy right now? Well, if I give you candy right now before I win, then that would break the streak. I'm supposed to give it to you after I won. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Good okay. call. You're right. Well, I got this, though. I found this what, in the what, trash. What's that? This is the Legacy of Legacy, Legacy. 2009 Legacy. Documentary. documentary. I found it in the trash. I, I don't know what to do with it. Some guy, I remember some creepy kid. He was all about oh, little kids. Creepy kid. And he was that. like, oh, I got this creepy stash. And I'm like, hey, guys, you want to do film this? And oh, that, that guy? I remember that guy. That guy. What do you want to do with it? I don't want it. I don't know. I don't, I don't remember what I even said in that. So, uh, you ready? Oh, in the main event. Are you ready? You were in the main event last year. I know. Now you're I know. I can't believe it. I wish I was in the main event fighting ZBZ one more time, but refing is even better. I'm going to call it right down the middle, let the best man win. You can't have a cake and eat it. I know. Dude, you're doing refing tonight? Yeah. Jer Jersey's on commentary and stuff. It's so Jersey's awesome. Here? Yeah, he's on commentary. Hey, Jersey, how you doing? I'm good. Yeah, you like my new haircut? Yeah, I think you came look good. Who, who are you talking to? Talking to Jersey. You want to talk to Jersey? He's upstairs on the table. Yeah, I know. I can talk to him. Silently. Okay. See, this is how it works. He can see you and hear you up on the table. Yeah. But you can't hear him or see him. I can hear him. You're uh, silent. We can all hear him. You can't hear him? We're no. supposed to all hear each other. We're crazy like that. I'll okay. see you outside. Okay, just walk through these steps. They're right this way. All right? Yeah. All right. Mm. So, I'm going to get ready for my match. Yeah. I, I can't wait to walk. Um. So, yeah, good, good luck in the main event. Stefan. Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh.
What's the I matter, lost Moody? my title. JT just fired me. Who? JT just fired you? <laughs> she got fired. You have to win a belt. He fired you. Are you kidding me? Damn it! Come on, come on. You gotta help me. Help you what? Shut up. You gotta help me score him over somehow. What? To, what? what? Come on! You, you want me to trust you? At the end of my damn rope, help me! No, I. I, I, I need a miracle. We go way back. We go way back. Oh, oh, so I get it. You, JT fired you, and, and you want to go back to the old days when me and you, I used to run out to the ring to my song, and you used to follow behind me and do your little thing and do do whatever it is you do. You want you want to go back to the old days? I just tell you, uh, I need I need some help. I need that. I'm so mad, at JT. I want you to help me get revenge on him. I can help you. I'll tell you what. I don't need your help. Actually, I want more championships and receive more fame that, since, you know, I lost the rights to you last year at Legacy, and I did the entire time when you were with me, or before that, so why would I want to go back that to That can't possibly be true. I haven't looked at the records or anything. But I'm not asking you to take me back. I'm asking you to team up to help me with JT, whom I hate right now. Um, I'll tell you what. First, why don't you... Hit the bricks down there, and um, take your pirate and look her ass somewhere else. You don't screw you guys. Ooh, look at Moody. <laughs> screw you guys. I'm going home. I'm going home. Hey, at least we still got job. She doesn't. She doesn't. Well, I, mean, I think she still works here. She's just not she does? manager. The following contest is for the WWE Pure Wrestling Championship, and we'll be decide. That's a 20 minute top four match. The winner is the person with most falls within 20 minutes. It is stipulated that the loser cannot challenge the pure champion until the pure champion actually loses his title. Entry first, the challenger from Lowell, Massachusetts, Johnny Seckle! And we've had quite an interesting night. A feud's coming to an end, blood being spilt, hatchets being buried, so to speak, and I don't think there's any more bad blood in all of WAW than there is between this man and JT Lambo. Proud to their feet, hang on, incoming! So far, Lady CX has a pretty goddamn good show, huh, guys? Alright, alright. What I got here in this bag is the original Pure Championship. After Lord of the Ring, JT Lambo threw this out in the trash. What a jerk is Brian! What a goddamn joke JT Lambo is! So, JT, hey, buddy, hope you're listening. Tonight, after I beat you, that big belt. But tonight, you ain't gonna get that at the end of the match. You're just gonna get a kick in the mouth and a kick in the dick. Cause I'm walking out! Pure champion! <laughs> now about to the ring, the WWE Pure Champion, heading for Chicago, Illinois, he's the urban legend, JT Lambo! The master horror on your street corner, make your mama mourn ya, the urban legend, the assassin of the dynasty, JT Lambo, and uh, conspicuously missing something, hang on, it's gonna come to me in a minute, um, Chaz, I'm drawing a blank, what's he missing here? So he didn't lose anything. My mistake. We've 
Rex Psycho saying numerous times that he was handed that title. He has defended it, to be fair. You know what? Yes, but he handed the title by Miss Moody Stein. But that same exact night, I forget who was president at the time. <laughs> I think it was me, it might have been me. He, whoever the president was forced him to actually have a match. All right, and he fought five other men to win that championship, to be the first pure champion. Well, these two are going to be locking up. I'm looking forward to this now. Here we go. Tie up. There it is. It is the way every pure wrestling championship match must begin. Collar elbow tie up, and where they go from there is entirely up to them. Well, I wonder, by the way, about a guy who's so concerned about the size of the championship belt. You know, Jason, I was saying the same thing. I mean, I thought the, the Pure Wrestling Championship was great. It's a throwback. It looks like back in the day, that's what professional... You know what, honestly? Professional wrestling championships are usually even smaller than that. It's not about the size of the belt. It's what it stands for. And the Pure Wrestling Championship is oh, one of the most down. prestigious championships in WWE. Accommodate. Get in your fault. Johnny Psycho using levers to pin the shoulders of J.C. Limbo. I'm sorry. You. And I'm your fault. Someone else is your title. All right, girls, girls, you're both beautiful. Can we get back to the match? I'm just trying to get some order here because we do have a match going on. JT trying to get... Hey, Chaz. Now what we got right here is beautiful Texas catch can wrestling between two men who have been going back and forth for the better part of two years. The fact is, whoever walks out winner and champion this match will not meet the other as long as they're champion. You're not going to find a climax to a feud as huge as this very often. No, These guys have been going back not. and forth for so long, you can barely remember how it started. But they were a tag team that looks like they were yep. going to be a good one. But Johnny Psycho opted out of the team, leaving JT High and and JT got pissed. Well, we also, it started. It's a lot has happened since. Well, uh, let's go all the way back to uh, your president reign, I believe it was, maybe? Or maybe when you were at this school originally. All right, the dynasty JT Lambo was a turn, or excuse me, JT Lambo was captain of Annihilation. Mooks was a turncoat. It was this whole organized thing to friggin' put sin as power as the president. Alright? Johnny Psycho took personal offense that he got used by JT Lambo. He got used, abused, and thrown to the curb. And since that, again, two years ago, they've been fighting back and forth. He said it best last week. Metal, blood, chairs, top rope turbulence. Every single match WAW has ever had, these two have been in, goddamn, everything but what? A friggin' what is that? A trick or treat match they never fought in. Well, we have exactly what the pure wrestling division is all about right here, and that is the chain wrestling, the grappling, mat wrestling. These guys know how to work. And work it they are. A lot of technical skill between the two of them. Both of them practically indestructible individuals. Anytime we have a pure championship match, it is always right next to it. Well, that pure championship match, well, that's match of the year. Held on last year, Falcon versus Christian Sane. That could have been match of the year. Hell, that was pure match of the year. The pure division, like you said, the WAW is the top. The pure division is amazing. And of course, both these men bring two different things to the table here. JT Lambo, a lot of power, a lot of skill, J uh, and can be very quick. Johnny Psycho, even quicker. Beautiful holding down the wrist lock. And one could argue a little more willing to do the damage to himself if it means hurting his opponent. These guys both bring unique skills to the table. Johnny Psycho is very versatile when it comes to the technical wrestling and the high flying and all that. But, you know, JT, to his credit, you say the same. Here it is. There right we go. Right. There we go. There's the athleticism, the acrobatics, wrenching the arm, twisting it in ways it's not supposed to be. Oh, uh, the fact is, with these two fighting each other for so long, as you know, Mr. Bender, when you're in the that long, you walk a feud all the time. All right? You know the person inside and out. You've got to change it up every time. You can't be pulling out the same trick, the same exact moves every single match. And Snapmare with authority, getting JT in the sleeper hold. That'll work it out fast, you find a way out of it. You need that energy, you need to be able to breathe. And working on that back. 
Now you could argue in some respect that's usually JT's shtick. Those legs of his are, should be registered weapons, and he will use them usually to hit you in the back with them. You know, I, I feel we're neglecting a point of this pure championship match. They say they talk, score, or mag. The person at the end of 20 minutes with the most victories, pit positions, is going to walk out as pure champion. Or there will be none in the 20, time, 20 minute time limit will be met. JT oh. will walk away with that championship. Except the pure division rules. If you're challenged, I, if you're offered to continue, the champion must accept. No, you don't have to look at me. I can hear you. You're right next to me. Keep your eyes on the action. That's what we're here to call. JT found a way out of that. Oh, oh my God. Five minutes has passed in this 20 minute contest. And Johnny Psycho, no place to go, tied up like a knot. Like scissors to the throat. Trying to get some. There he is. There Now there's the elasticism of Johnny Psycho. Very quick, very tricky. And headlock takedown again. Two. Nope. Very close, though. But the other half, I would argue, and again, Jason, you've been in the ring. Chaz, you've kind of been in the ring. 20 minutes. 20 minutes where you can't end this. You have to go the whole way. There's no pin. There's no immediate submission. There's no upset into the corner. No upset that's going to save you. You have to go all the way, and the amount of endurance it takes. Oh, my God. Right, there's something that we call work rate in the business, and that's how long you go know, until you start running out of gas. We do get guys, but I can tell you, most of us, once you get past the 10 minute mark, it gets hard. After 15 minutes, it's that much harder. You don't have a lot of gas left in the tank. To go 20 minutes is a lot harder than it's done. And these two men, of course, are just pounding the hell out of each other, doing damage wherever they can. Well, when you're in a type of match like this, a top top man, Usually you actually try to start off slow. These two men don't like each other. They hate each other. They despise each other. They're going to do whatever they can to make sure the other person becomes... Oh, big kicks. Now, see, there it is. That Those legs, that shin of his. I swear to God, he's got a metal plate in there. And the loser is not going to get another shot at the pure wrestling championship as long as the winner is champion. And face... Oh, God. And this could be the first fall we see. One, two, nope, Psycho gets out. There's an interesting strategy at play when there's a score involved in the match. You might actually allow yourself to take a fall to conserve energy. If you can guarantee that you're going to get back up and work by a play possum, it can work to your advantage. Really tricky. Now Psycho's going to need every advantage he can get in this one. JT Lambo, again, to be fair, has defended that title against some of the best. Joey Staples, good example. And hang on. J J Johnny got him locked down. No place to go. Oh, no knees to the back. I would say the best strategy in a match of this kind is to strategically pick up Hold on. Landing. Fact is, you see him working on the elbow, the shoulder of JT Lambo. Trying to probably set him up to once he locks in the hand again on the vice. It's a straight tap out right away. Like you said, it goes back to your strategy you said earlier. Yeah, faster the better. When you're in a submission in a match like this, you might choose to tap out even if you think you can fight your way out. Because you might lose so much strength and stamina trying to fight your way out. It's not worth it. Tap out and move on. And, and, and hold on. Oh, Urban Legend with the Lambo cutter. And there was a mistake, I think. Hang on. One, two. Nope, not enough, but Psycho probably would be smarter to keep JT off his feet. Keep that power vertical. How he kicked out of that, I have no idea. Or sorry, oops, sorry, horizontal. But yes. How much more he's got to go. Turning him over. Oh, God. And this guy got more friggin' moves than that. Okay, and another Swiss Army knife. He can come at you at any angle. Psycho trying to get to that rope. Can't do it. And there it is. It might not look like he just gave up a point, but it's smart because there's still a lot of time left in this match, and you do not want to waste it fighting a submission. He could have held that for 10 minutes if he wanted to. It's going to do more damage to try to fight your way out and to hold on. And of course, that means that JT has to hold it in there, and you're wearing him out. And Psycho back to his feet. 
the score right now. JT Lambo up by one. Johnny Psycho zero. JT has one fall. Psycho has zero falls. Still a ways to go before these guys can walk away from this contest. And here we go. Reversal into the corner again. Johnny Psycho getting the speed going. This is his strong suit. Incoming. Big forearm to the face. Wait and Bulldog out of the corner. With the Bulldog out of the corner, baby. High velocity, high impact. That's the way Johnny Psycho plays. One, two. Absolutely Not enough. Weak cover. There's no way he's going to capitalize. Well, the fact is, you're right. High velocity. The thing is, you keep doing that through a whole freaking top point match. What's going to happen? You're going to burn out before the time is up. And you're not going to be able to do anything. And of course, and that's the, that's the other thing, the high risk maneuvers, they they don't work. Oh, wow. One miscalculation. You're taking a bad hit that you put yourself into. They're only halfway through this contest and they're already showing signs of battle scars and damage done. These guys are not going to take it easy on each other. It's not just about the championship either. There's so much bad. Oh, oh my God. Hold on. Oh my God! Gun wrench power bomb onto the apron. Ow! Ah! Uh. No man's land does not apply in the division. Ah, no, it does not. Red guy has jurisdiction in and out of the ring. Six. And JT got the advantage here. Psycho hurting, and now here we go. Over. Now you kind of think he was uh, a little bit of mocking to Johnny Psycho, doing kind of a mock uh, match. Of And JT lightening the load a little bit, probably trying to keep oh, it. Oh, oh, up. One, two, three, there it is. And there it is. You see Johnny Psycho working very smart there, catching him off guard. Oh, oh, oh. Even and out the score. Hit for it fast with that bicycle kick, though. I gotta give JT some credit. Shoot! Me in the corner. Uh, like Bishop brought up, he was handed the championship in the first place when it was created, when it was instituted. Um, however, in his latest reign, oh, to actually streamlined the rules of pure division to be easier to understand and, and, and better to work within in the guidelines. I gotta give him credit for that. Oh. I think if there's been one folly in this division, as exciting as it has been, uh, some of the fans have had difficulty following this specific rule. Regulations. Big kick. Single kick. Tri tree of right. woe. Second count out. Three rope breaks from the top rope. You can't throw, physically throw your opponent outside. They're confusing, and every time a new champion came along, they changed the rule. You put yourself in the top. I do. And it's one of the low tricks in the division. The champion has the ability to streamline the rules when he sees fit. I think that this rule. Slave on cutter. Nowhere. Nowhere. And this might be number two. One, two, three. Two, one, JT. Psycho. Psycho has taken a lot of abuse in this. Now Pete's going to JT level has two falls. Psycho has one fall. To be fair, to be fair, JT has been, I won't say dominating, but he has certainly had more of an advantage. I did have the privilege of talking to Johnny Psycho before the show, asking him if it comes down to it, if you win this match, do you plan on on keeping the rules the same? And he looked at me and said, if, if I win this match, I gotta love that. He's got the winning spirit all He does. The time. I mean, that, Johnny Psycho's been with WAW off and on for years. But the thing is, the poor guy's never been to the top of the mountain. This right here bringing him to legacy, pure championship. This is where Johnny Psycho wants to be. This is where Johnny Psycho should be. That is a career peak, especially since if he wins tonight. Oh! Break the record. He'll be the first four-time pure champion. And Psycho just oh, laughing. Just laughing. Oh, into the mush. Living up to his namesake. And as you said, we are just halfway past this match. And as Jason mentioned earlier, this is where the stamina, this is where one, two, no, wait a minute. He's locking in the Anaconda Vice right there. The Anaconda Vice is being locked in by JT Lambo to Johnny Psycho. He can't afford this. No. Oh, there it is. Two. He's up three. Submissions are becoming a really smart strategy. We're at three, three to one, JT. JT has three falls. Michael has one fall. 
Johnny Psycho is in the unfortunate position of playing a catch-up game, and that is not where you want to be in a contest like this. No, no, especially in a contest JT against JT. The king of the pure division, the pioneer. He's not just saying and the most. Whoa, wait a oh, minute. Over. Catches. Oh, wow. Very slambo cutter to JT Lambo. Little payback. Cutter. One, two, three. The catch-up game is off to a good start. He's got one more to go before he ties this. He is back in the game, and it didn't take a second. Oh, that is said earlier. Psycho, very dangerous. You can't count him out very quick. Knows how to use his speed. Sending JT out. And again, playing a little bit of possum in some respect, as you mentioned earlier, Jason. He can't spend the full 20 minutes playing catch-up, though. At some point, he's going to have to take the lead and maintain it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That'll scramble your eggs. Five minutes left. It's not considered using a weapon, even though, I'll tell you, the wall is just as bad as a steel chair. Well, I'll tell you this right now. The wall is pretty much going to go back to the old company that we did with the Kelly. You remember those very well. He was in every match. No to get counted out, and that's going to count as another point for JT, but he resets the count up. That's JT's problem right there. And we are a bit of an eat, well, a little bit of an eat. A little bit. <laughs> that was one of the cockiest things I've ever seen. If well, this comes down to a one point spread and Psycho runs away with it, he's going to regret that. Oh, well, there was this one time. Of Hanging out with Captain too much. That was pretty cocky right there. And what oh, is going no. on here? oh my god, no. Five. He's fighting every Oh game. my god. Exploit the rules. He can't hit him with a chair, but he can pull up the mats. He can hit him with the wall. And you're talking about the original pure championship. What is he doing here? Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. No, 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 no. oh my god. It's not just illegal, it'll get you fired. And back body drop! Turn it around. Body drop on JT Lambo by Johnny Psycho. Johnny Psycho is bleeding. Well, we are, we are past the five minute mark. Coming down to the home stretch. Johnny Psycho right there. I'm not sure if he caught his hand on a corner of a brick or something. His face ate brick wall. That's what happened. His face. Do you ever listen to yourself some nights, Chaz? I do. It's the most oh. Okay. And anyway, hold on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. One, two, three. We are less than, we are less than five minutes. The score is tie. And Crimson Mask. Has three falls. JT Limbo has three falls. But this is important to remember. The bell rings and the score is still three to three. JT walks away from the championship. Well, no matter what, the meter busted open. As you promised, Jason Ambers. And with Psycho. Todd Hawk. Iris maneuver that paid off. Losing blood in a tough score match. I mean, you got to go 20 minutes and then... All right, this is bad news. Johnny Psycho should not be doing this. This is opens too many opportunities, too many potential. Thumb of the double axe handle. It pays off. Taking chances and they are paid off time and time again. Johnny Psycho is a gambler and it doesn't always pay off, but when it does, it pays But he's going to the well. Wait. All right, here we go. Cat trick coming in. There it is. He gets it. Did you just steal my line? Psycho gets it at the same time, actually. He's going for four. He's going for around the world. Oh, my. Oh, my. And up, oh, oh, over, try. does he connect? Oh, oh God. Splash, and he had nobody there. We, like, diving into an empty pool. And that could cost him. We made it down to seconds here. One pin, one submission. And we got blood all over the floor. Oh, it's, like, it's like Chatterick said. He went to the well one too many times. And that time, he dove into an empty well. Which is, you know, personally, it's painful. And it doesn't end well either. <laughs> Maybe setting up, putting in the. Oh corner. my God! Hilo Moon Salt coming up right here. Oh my God! Hilo Moon Salt catching Johnny Psycho perfectly. And one, two, no! Wow! Oh my God! You gotta be kidding me! What's he got left? The Pure Wrestling Division showcases the best talent in WWE oh. time and time again. JT Lambo getting taken out with those knees to the cranium. For a championship so new, it is so coveted and so hotly contested. I am so proud of the rest of the And Psycho heading upstairs. Oh my god, oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Oh! He lands on his feet, but oh, lands on that knee. That could have popped his knee right up. Let's bring you back to 2005, I believe it was.
Find that in the team championship ladder match. John is the nasty guy right on his knee, Mr. Danvers. I hate his career for a little bit, actually. I hate to interrupt you, Chaz, but we're down to one minute. Johnny Psycho, unfortunately, now could be at a disadvantage. JT up. Oh, no. In the picture. Oh! Knee to the side of the head. That was a shin to the temple. And Johnny Psycho, blood, crimson mask, and all, is barely getting to his feet. And now JT. JT has no! And now Psycho coming in like a freight train. Psycho's got 30 seconds less than to win this contest. Less than 30 seconds. We're probably down to about 20 now. If he doesn't get a fall, then that's JT's. And JT. Oh, oh no. Misses it. Denied. Denied. There it is. Come on. What's he got? JT actually showing a bit of respect there. Shaking the hand, wait for it, and there it is. All right. from Caesar, Caesar again, Giant, JT shaking Johnny's hand, and Johnny now enjoying his, his victory. Walking out a legacy, pure champion, the purest of pure champions, walking out with two belts, which were flabbergasted, I won't lie, I thought that was all JT Lambo.